If your ink's too slow and your nib won't flow, here's one of the places that you can go. Larry is here to see you through with Mr. Announcer and Cubby too. It's Larry's Fountain Pen Review. Hey folks, my name is Larry and I live here in Fort Worth, Texas. And today I'd like to present to you a beautiful, stunning writing instrument and a pen of excellence, in my opinion. It's Visconti fountain pen. And uh, I will let Mr. Announcer read a, give you a little detail when he reads about the pen because what I think really special about this pen, you're going to hear the creator. Well, I'll go ahead and tell you because I can't wait. This pen is made from a stunning resin. Beautiful resin, I'll say. It is a knockout to die for resin pen. But it's created by Jonathan Brooks. In the United States of America, right here, hand turned in Florence, Italy. So, I believe if I get this right, the Johnson books created the beautiful resin, and then all that went to Italy and Florence, and then they did their Italy thing and turned the pen, then created this beautiful, elegant fountain pen. So, let me let you look at it. Enough of me. Look at this beautiful fountain pen. It is stunning. And when you take it outside, can you see that sparkles in there? Look at that. In the light, this thing just lights up the sky like stars up in the sky. Beautiful, gorgeous fountain pen. So I am going to let Mr. Announcer do the honors and read a little bit about this pen. Part of the Astral Collection, this Nova Blue Visconti Medici is made from a stunning resin created by Jonathan Brooks in the United States and hand-turned in Florence, Italy. This fountain pen features an 18 karat ruthenium plated gold nib, double reservoir power filler system, and is individually numbered out of 118 pieces. The pen is further enhanced by a clear center band engraved with the Medici name. This window gives the user a clear view of the pen's remaining ink level. The pen cap is secured with Visconti's popular hook safe lock closure system. As a tribute to one of the greatest dynasties in Italian history, Visconti divined, designed the Medici. The family was a noble house that stood out for their political, financial, and cultural influence on the city of Florence. Most of all, the Medici family was known for their passionate contributions to the development of humanism and the Italian Renaissance. The body of Visconti's Medici Astral features an eight-sided facet design modeled after the Florentine Baptistry, a religious place and symbol of the city's glorious past. Now, this pen was purchased from Federalist Pens and Paper. So, if you're interested in this pen, check out Federalist Pens and Paper. Also, I believe Lena at Pen Boutique may carry them as well. I'm sure she does. They're pretty much all over the place, I believe, by now. And they come in, uh, I think, extra fine, fine, medium, and broad. Uh, nib sizes again 18k go uh, now the length of the pen overall close is going to be about 5.72 inches and overall posted about 6.77 76 inches and 
The weight's going to be about 127 to 128. I'm sorry, that would be ounces, but we're going to go 36 Gs, okay, on the weight. And it is a piston vac. And if you wanted to... Now that's not really too bad, what do you think? Post it. But you don't have to, but I don't, it doesn't look too bad, post it. Doesn't look too gaudy, don't you? Don't, 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 to me, I, I don't think it looks fine. But you don't want to scratch your pins up. So, anyway, so there. So, uh, there's the ink window, and it's got the name right there. I don't know if you can see it. Beautiful pen, studding pen. And hopefully, I will have enough ink in here to write. I have filled it up twice. Well, you know me. There we go. I think there's a little in that reservoir left. Thank you. That's got the reservoir. So let's get to writing. And the ink I'm using is Visconti Blue. Yes. Yes, sir. So, beautiful fountain pen, is it not? Gorgeous. I fell in love with it. And let me look at the nib one more time. Okay. That's a broad nib. Now I do love the blue Visconti ink. They did a great job on the ink color. And that ink really goes nicely with this fountain pen, I believe. Nice and wet, smooth. This pen has no problem whatsoever with keeping up with the ink. There's no skips. Wet, smooth, it delivers. Just a really great fountain pen. So there you have it. The Visconti Medici, is that how you say it? Okay. There you have it, folks. What's your thoughts on this beautiful pen? Great looking pen. Right? Right. Right. Friends, thank you for joining me today. Hey, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, don't you think it's time to hit that subscribe button while you're at it? Hit the bell so it'll notify you when I upload a video. And don't forget to check out my Larry Fountain Pen Zoom Pen Hangout. <clears throat> That's always a lot of fun. We have a blast on there, and I bring special guests on. And you can meet them, you can interact with them, we can have a great time. I try to put this all together just for you guys. So, God bless each and every one of you. Peace and love, kind to a stranger. As always, my good friends, please don't text and drive. God bless, bye-bye, and good luck to Jim Hines and Frank and Marky at Federalist Pens and Paper and everybody else out there at that Philly Pin Show. Good luck. Rock on, Pin Pilks. Bye-bye.